They're shooting with their guns, but in a weird way. <laughs> All right, what is up? We are back with some more Manx for some Manx madness. Uh, we're playing on the weekly brawl uh, once more. Uh, this brawl we have the uh, hybrids uh, right here, and we also have stronghold going on. So we got a base being constructed, and we have no middle income. So let me do this if I can. Oh, I can't. Okay. Did my entire team leave? Oh, this is gonna be an interesting game. I, I my entire team left me. Wow, okay. Well, we are gonna really see the true power of Manx now if uh, we have Aegis Guard spawning every wave. Oh my god, August Grad spawning every wave. Okay, we have to do this. We have to make August Grad happen. But I also have to stabilize so that I don't um, just get beat up. Let's just let's just go half and half with these rocket launchers, I think. Okay, I'm gonna have an Aegis Guard on every single wave. I don't know, man. I feel like, I feel like Aegis Guard every single wave might be pretty strong. Uh, my team left me. I clearly upgrade, had a Zerg opponent. Complete. I mean, a Zerg ally. Maybe like, um... Upgrade, oh god, upgrade complete. Oh no, is it the Haka? Well, good thing I have, uh... More age. I have, I have more Aegis Guards than usual. Yeah, there we go. He ate him. He ate him. But there's another one. There's another one. There's another one. My team left me. Let's do it. They left me a little too early in the game, though. Like, it's like, it gonna be hard. Oh god, Abathur. Oh no, the roaches! I just got hard countered by the roaches! Oh my goodness, the one Aegis Guard. We're gonna need more. Is this guy level 3 yet? Okay, we have a second Aegis Guard here at least. He's blasting, he's blasting. Um. Oh boy. I don't think Manx does well into this. There's too many enemies. Okay, I need, I think I, think I, gotta, su I gotta support, I gotta support my Aegis Guard with some flame troopers, I think. We gotta get some fire boys. Get some flame boys. What's up? I, I can't. I can't just go pure ages. This is this, this is going to be an interesting round. I'm I'm glad I got this opportunity to, to uh, play this. Um, let's see. The SC, SCV is repairing. The supply depot is automatically generating creep. He's just going to eat my Aegis guard. There we go. Just ate him right there. But there's another one. And this guy's rank three, so he's out for blood. Get him, boys. I'm gonna have to stay tier one for this. Let's see. Flamethrower boys. I think because Manx tier one is still pretty good. Um. Flamethrower boys, let's go. Purge him. Come on, Aegis Guard. It's all up to you. It's up to you now. Oh no. Wait, we got Flamethrower boys coming in. Let's go. Burn him. Burn him. Oh. He can't attack. Oh, but we got more we got more boys. We got more flamethrower boys. Come on, Aegis Guard. Oh. Oh. We're actually hauling it. We're pushing back. Okay, I think I just I need more flamethrower boys. Like that one that one Aegis guard in the back. Uh, okay, okay, let's go. Come on. I think the Hawk is gonna be my be the toughest guy to beat because he's gonna eat my one Aegis guard. But I need to get more Aegis guards. Good thing I have my stronghold supporting me. Let's go. Oh, let's go, baby. Manx flame trooper Aegis guard. Get them, boys. Get them, boys. Purge, purge. Yeah, like these little cone caps on their head. It looks ridiculous. <laughs> They're like little garden gnomes. Oh my god, I got three Aegis guards stacked up here. That is no joke, by the way. Three level three Aegis guards this early in the game is actually gonna mess you up. Oh my goodness. Uh, I don't even have hybrid leveled up yet, because I've just been trying to I've just been trying to survive. And I guess I survived. Let's let's get more flame troopers, but uh oh my goodness. That Aegis guard, we're gonna knock out that cannon. Oh my goodness. That was a little nasty, guys. That was a little disgusting. Um uh, Let's see, so Artanis is still tier 1. Uh, we got a lot of flame troopers here. Uh, these boys got their machine guns out though. Uh, wow, those Dragoons are getting beat up by that Aegis Guard. Whoa, oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm going to try and get, go for another Aegis Guard. I'm just going to stay tier 1. I think if I go Zerglings then, I'm staying tier 1. I think that's what I'm going to have to do. Because um, I don't think I can do anything else besides uh, just keep mashing my face with Aegis Guard. Okay, there's another Aegis Guard coming out. Every 20 seconds, we got Aegis Guards coming out. And now we have double the Aegis Guards. This is actually just... This is amazing. This is better than I expected it would be. Because um, I wanted to do a Mass Aegis Guard video, um, but I didn't know how I was going to pull it off, because, you know, Mass Aegis Guards, like, it's only average. But now that we're spawning every single wave, it suddenly went from only being average to being quite good. I would say, quite good. Because now we have two Aegis Guards now. And now we got some Flame Boys. Double Aegis Guard Flame Boys. Let's go. Burn them up. Burn them up. Burn them up. We need more Flame Boys. Oh, we got a Hellbat though. Hellbat's gonna come here and help my Aegis Guards out. Let's go. 
Oh, oh, we got we got so many Marines too. I got my Marines backing me up. We got my that's this is the real Dominion Army, dude. Dominion Army uh, along with the Imperial Guard. All right, let's go. Um, uh, let's get some more Flame Boys. I think. I think I need more Flame Boys. Uh, and I think I, I think I got uh, start upgrading the Flame Boys. Okay, so he's got Ravasaurs. Uh, so if he's got Ravasaurs, I have to get some Zerglings. I think. Uh, let this wave spawn, and then I'm gonna go Zerglings. Uh, Zerglings will be bad against Artanis, but um, I think it'll be decent against the Haka. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Oh my God, my opponent left the game. Oh shoot! Here we go. They're getting overrun by the Manx, the Manx horde. I'm still on tier one, by the way. Tier one Manx. Let's go. Get them, boys. Get them, boys. We're spawning three times as much, boys. Oh, oh wait, he has swarm hosts. That might be bad. I have no detection. I have no detection, guys. And I have no allies to rely on for detection. Avatar's gonna start pushing me back. Uh, okay, I need, I need to go tier 2. I need to go tier 2. God damn. Uh, here we go. I think Alarak has detection on tier 1, I think, with his uh, with his Havocs. I'm not sure. Yeah, he has tier 1 detection. Wow, that's really strong. Okay, we're, I'm gonna have to suffer these swarm posts for a little longer. Um, okay, you're pushing out with the hybrid behemoths. Okay, the hybrid behemoths are gonna fall to my Aegis Guards, though. Just simply because they're armor. Uh, Alright. Oh, okay, come on. Let's go. Let's go. We need, we need some. We need some more zerglings. My zerglings coming in here. There's so many of them. Flame troopers, zerglings. Let's go. Purge, purge. Burn the infestation. Okay, we need more Aegis guards. I only have two of them. There's an archon coming out. Oh baby, this is gonna be a game. This is gonna be a game. Um. Oh, intercessors. Do I not have intercessors? I wasn't going tier two. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, I was going tier two this whole time. Okay, those swarm hosts are gonna end up pushing me back then. Uh, the Ghost Academy should have the nuke on it, I think. I think. I don't know. Okay, well then, well then that was that was foolish of me. Uh, I thought I was going tier two this whole time. Okay, well we're not, we're gonna have to manage without detection for a little bit. Uh, but once we get detection, uh, we should be able to uh, take control again. Uh, and then let's go for some gas. And then I think I need I need I need another Aegis guard. I need I need more Aegis guards. Like I have a lot of boys here, uh, but we're gonna need some Aegis guards. I'm at I might get some Ultralisk on the side. I don't even know. Uh, let's get a let's get a let's get another Flame Trooper down. Put him down here. Put him down here. Okay, and I got scans. I got scans now. Uh huh. Uh, but we're nowhere close to the Swarm Hosts. Oh, the Swarm Hosts are right there. Okay, so I need to get it. I need to get a witness, and then the witness will help buff my my boys as well. And uh, that will be very useful. And I have a witness every wave, and so they'll just be witnesses everywhere. We're gonna witness everything. All right, here we go. He's got some. He's got a yellow swarm host here. It looks like we're smashing our way through this. We finally got some detection coming out. We're gonna go put down a witness right here. Oh, well, that's not that's not centered. Centered. Okay, there we go. Um, he's got some phoenixes. Okay, so that means it's time for me to make some rocket boys. Uh, that's a great sign for rocket boys. Ooh, look at that. Look at that damage. Um, these phoenixes are just gonna chill there, though. They're gonna, not gonna do anything against me uh, for some time. I think it's Rocket Boy time. So it's Rocket Boys. Rocket Boys gonna have to go back here. Uh, all right, Rocket Boy, come on. Uh, let's go. Give him the trooper standing by. Give him this. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, how are we performing? Our fusion core is on fire. That's okay. Uh, that is okay. Can I push past this? I think I need more Aegis guards and less troopers. Um, yeah, that's probably the answer. I need some Aegis Guards. I need I need a lot more Aegis Guards. Maybe I get some Hydralisk, actually. Um, it's 100 for a Hydralisk. So... Ah, uh, but Hydralisk don't have any range. That's the only problem. You know what? It's fine. Let's get some Hydralisk. Let's see how they perform. Let's see how Manx Hydralisk perform. Uh, I don't expect them to perform very well. They're probably the worst Hydralisk in the game. Worse than the Haka Hydralisk. Because they don't even have uh, range upgrades uh, for them. Okay, so... Avatar is slowly pushing me back with his uh, Swarm Host. Um, let's see. We got the witnesses going. Let's go. We're purging that stuff, and let's 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 get let's start focusing on getting uh, more world guards, more Aegis guards. Uh, there we go. Oh, but oh, we did not get onto their swarm hosts. My wave is just incapable of getting onto swarm hosts because I have too many small units. I think I need I need more big units. I need ultralis. Uh, there we go. We are knocking out his phoenix. Uh, his phoenixes are picking up my zerglings, so that's not really that important either. Um, my Hydralisks are actually doing quite well, because they're being ignored, largely, because they're in the back. Um, so that's actually a better performance in my Hydralisks than I wagered for. Uh, but they just went down as well. That is a lot. That is a lot, guys. 
Uh, but my lings come for free, so I don't. I'm not really uh, too bummed out about losing them there. Um, there we go. Oh, look at all that stuff there. Um, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Um, shock divisions. I need something for AOE. Probably just more Aegis Guards, to be honest, let's be honest. More Aegis Guards. So he's shooting down my witnesses with those things. But uh, my witness is quite tanky. Um, so, yeah. Okay, it looks like we're running out of fire. We're, we're running out of flame boys a little too early. Um, this guy's leveling up, though. Uh, we, need, we need some more flame boys. Some will die so that others may live. I do what must be safeguarding the future. Not enough minerals. Okay, let's just do that. We need more flame boys. We need more. We need much more flame boys than we have right now. Uh, Aegis Guard's coming in. Let's see. Uh huh. The Phoenixes are shooting everyone. There we go. The Witness goes down. Uh, I think all my flame boys are getting bursted down by the Archons. Uh, ooh. Artanis really used the shields right there. Hmm. Okay, I think I need, I, need, I need to start hitting tier 4 though for the hybrid behemoths, I think. That's what I really need them for. Uh, they're shooting with their guns, but in a weird way. <laughs> they're holding it to the side. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go tear up if I can. Um, let's go. Where's my witness? Oh my god, they're all the way back there. Uh, I can't get to the swarm host. Ah, the swarm host. I just can't get to them. I have too many small units. I think that's the problem. Okay, I need, I need to hit next tier then. I need to get some Ultralisk on the field. I think the Ultralisk will help me. Uh, it'll help me uh, punch through much better. Okay, so my Rocket Boy's in the back. Uh, there we go. There we go. Aegis Guards, let's go. Aegis Guards getting overwhelmed now. Oh my goodness, that is a huge swarm of Locusts. Uh, Aegis Guards are still surviving though. They're still surviving. We're going to get onto the Swarm Host. Are we? Can we? Oh, Avatar's Toxic Nest just blew up. Okay, those Swarm Hosts are going down now that we see them. Oh, okay. We, we gotta crack the Swarm Hosts. Okay, we're going to Tier 3 right now. Um, by the way, if you guys enjoyed this video so far and you enjoy Manx, um, I have a Manx playlist. I'm gonna pop it in the description down below. Um, and so you can feel free to check it out. Um, yeah. Let's see. Okay, here we go. And in, this Manx, in the Manx playlist, I'm, I've been showcasing Manx, like, since... I think his second release, like his first release I didn't get a chance to because I didn't have premium yet. His second release though I did, and his second release he, he, his units were much, much more broken. Uh, he's scanning me, well here's an Ultralisk, here's an Ultralisk, hope you like it. Um, I mean, there's only one person to scan, so really, uh, it makes sense that he's scanning me. Get some Dominion weapons, get some Dominion armor. Uh, I actually don't have a, oh he's, he's scanning me for a hybrid push, okay. Um, let's see how well I do into this hybrid push. I want to see because okay, there's just three hybrids, um, but the but one of them is just going down to these Aegis guards to impact. Okay, so the hybrids are not a problem. My Aegis guards just knocked them out. He just knocked them out outright. Okay, so, so that actually that actually just did nothing. That hybrid push actually just did nothing. Um, I'm gonna put down some ultralisk over here. Um, oh, I just realized I need some more ultralisk. I need to back this one up a bit. So let's back it up and then put it over here. I think that's where I want it. Uh, let's get some more Aegis Guards, because I'm spawning Aegis Guards and Ultralisk every wave, along with all these Zerglings. It's going to be quite difficult for him to deal with. Uh-oh, uh I ran out of money. Okay, well, let's get, let's, let's, let's get more Flame Boys. These Flame Boys are actually doing quite well. Uh, they're probably the most worthwhile Dominion Trooper to get after um, your Goliaths. Your Goliaths. These guys are literally just Goliaths. Um, Alright, here we go. Uh, well, I'm gonna save up for my hybrid push because I, I got I got 2k worth of um, stuff on my hybrid Switch right now. Some will die, uh, others may live. Do that. Make them some their default flame troopers. Here we go. Like they sent the hybrid swarm into me and them out. It didn't do anything. Uh, there are a lot, a lot of swarm hosts, but we are we are burning through it. The power of the emperor. Uh, we shall overcome. Uh, any obstacle, you know, as, as Manx would say. Uh, okay, so all those Zerglings just got Psy Storm. Um, all of my boys at the front that didn't die to the Psy Storm are now dying to the Dragoons. Oh, baby. Uh, but my Aegis Guards are still going. The, the important part is that the Aegis Guards are providing lots of DPS. And uh, as long as they are up, that's all that matters. Uh-oh. Aegis Guards. Oh, no. They're getting Vipered. Um, well, I mean, there's another wave of guys coming in now, so that's fine. Totally fine. Let's get some. Let's get some uh, armor upgrades. 
I could probably get some Earth Splitter Ordnance to just bombard the Locust for me. I think that would be very helpful. The Ultralists are going down. There are Locusts everywhere. Um, jeez. It's a small... I think they're definitely pushing into me, though. And I definitely need to start thinking about getting something else. Um, hmm. They have a lot of anti-armor, but I also don't have anything else because I'll use our armor. Um, I can probably put on some medevacs, let's see. Let's get two medevacs, and then let's get more Aegis Guards. We need we need more Aegis Guards, I think. That's that's all I'm missing. Um, and then we're gonna go for, we're gonna wait for a late hybrid push. I'm gonna go for a massive hybrid push. See if I can get to like eight hybrids like I did in that Phoenix video in the tier list. Uh, if you guys have not seen the Phoenix tier list video, I'm gonna put a card up right now. You can go check it out. Um, let's see. We are, we are burning. They have the shields up on his guys. Okay. Uh, Not enough. Is this is this working? Is this working? Okay. So, do my do my medivacs heal? Are they healing? Oh, they got feedback by the archons. Nice. Archon feedback. Okay. Uh, scatter veil. I could get scatter veil. Nah, nah, nah. That's not worth it. I don't need scatter veil. I don't need I don't need stealth on my uh, medivacs. The heck. Let's go. Okay. How, how I have four rocket boys. All I have are these four rocket boys for anti air. I think I need more rocket boys for anti air. Yeah, I need more rocket boys. Uh, my medivacs are healing. We are on their swarm host lines. We are pounding away. There are no more swarm hosts, I think. Oh no, there's still some more over there. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, okay. Let's see. I'm gonna need some more rocket boys, I think. Yeah. Safeguarding the future. Rocket boys, let's go. Get them rockets on. I need some more anti-air presence. But it looks like, okay, so there's Reavers coming out now. Reavers are going to be quite tough for me to deal with. Um, I should probably start thinking of getting a Shock Division, I think. I need some Shock Divisions now. Like, uh, the five Aegis Guard spam is good and all, but uh, I'm going to need some Shock Divisions. Like, like these Aegis Guards are ripping apart everything, though. Like, look at that. That Abathur frontline just got demolished, but as soon as the next wave of Locust spawn, I don't have enough guys left alive. It's just my Aegis Guards. Um... But I, the good thing is, though, I got more Aegis Guards coming in, so... Uh, let's get Incapacitator Shell so it can slow at least. I don't know if the slow is going to make any difference uh, at all. Uh, I should probably get on my fourth gas, though. That's the thing. I don't have that yet. Uh, and that's kind of bad for me. Um, I really want to save for Shock Division, but you know what? I get the fourth gas right now. Um, we can wait for Shock Divisions later. Um, oh, he grabbed my Witness, but not that was not the important one, though. So that's fine. Um, okay, we're pummeling that line, we're blowing it up, oh my god, look at the amount of swarm hosts that are on the ground here, that is just seriously large amounts of swarm hosts, I do not have enough boys here, we ran out of boys, guys, like, they're all dying to the side storm, which is, uh, pretty bad, okay, I have 6,000, I have 3,000, that means I can get 6 hybrid behemoths now, I can probably save for a death push, um, but I don't have enough stacking units, don't know if it's gonna be good enough just to run in with Aegis Guards. Like they're slowly pushing me over the mid the mid wave. Like it's these Abathur Swarm hosts that I cannot deal with right now. Because my I don't have enough big big strong units at the front. Um, I only have three Ultralists. Um, here we go. They're charging in. They're charging in. They're going chop chop. They're chop chopping the wave. Um, but they are they are dying horrendously. I am dropping a scan. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna need a shock division right now. Put that shock division down. Uh, is this guy not placed symmetrically? I don't know. Uh, symmetrical. Symmetrical placements, you know. Uh, okay, so... I probably need more... I probably need more... Um, oh, these guys are still... These guys are still going here? Uh oh Rocket boy. Uh, okay, so I need more rocket boys. Okay, so they're... I need, I need flame boys as well. Rocket boys and flame boys. Uh, let's see. Uh, but it looks like those Vipers are being very, very strong against me. Like, they are blinding my Aegis Guards, and they cannot fire at all. Um, my one Shock Division in the back is doing its best. Uh, but I mean, I'm going to have more Shock Divisions, because they're going to start stacking quite fast. Uh, so that should help out uh, massively. Uh, let's put down another one of these Ultralists. Uh, here we go. Let's go. So they're shielding up. I got a shock. I need, I need smart circles, I think. Smart circles. Um, and we're going to have to start getting um, aim assist embrasures. We're going to have to get some tankiness on our boys. Because uh, it looks like we're going to have to rope a dope. I'm going to try and last to get eight behemoths and push with that. I don't know if I can. Let's see if I can. 
aim assist and bracers. Uh, but oh my goodness, look at all those. He's going guardians now too. Um, and that means I need, like, the one weakness I have is that I take a lot of time to prep my units because they need to train. Um, but I think my rocket boys are doing a great job, actually. Um, they actually obliterated those vipers quite quickly. But um, other than that, they're, they they don't stay alive long enough. Like, as soon as the end... Oh my god, my front line melts, and then they're on some of my rocket boys. Um, let's see. Let's see. So we're getting side storm here. Rocket boys, fire boys. I think I just need some more fire boys in the back. Maybe. Like more fire boys. I need more flame boys. Uh, more fire boys. Okay, so I think we might have to we might have to settle for seven units. That's what we that's what might that's what we might have to settle for. Um, because we got we got a got a haul. Uh, and with seven behemoths, I can probably get my get access to um, a large wave of units afterwards. Um, Actually, no, the Rocket Boys are dealing very well with the Guardians. Holy. Those Guardians just got eliminated. Um, so probably more Rocket Boys in the back, then. Uh, more Rocket Boys. Um, okay. So the Shock Division is leveled up to rank 3. Uh, that should be very good, because the rank 3 Shock Division is quite powerful. Like, insanely powerful. Uh, let's go, Shock Division. Come on. Get that 125 damage going. Boom. Okay, I got I got another ultralist coming out, so let's just put him down right here. Uh, let's put down some flame boys. Uh, flame boy. I think this guy. Yeah, it's just this guy, right? There we go. Let me organize my units right now. Okay, there we go. So we're actually actually with these double hoss like these double shock divisions stacked up here. That was pretty good for us. Oh, and then they all died. Uh, where's my other shock division? Oh, it's back there. Okay. Because I, I am crashing into this Artanis wave and just completely annihilating it. That's the thing. Uh, so he's going with the hybrids. Um, I can go for a five hybrid push right about now. You know, I mean, seven hybrid push. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. Now that is monstrosity. That is a monstrosity you should be careful of. Uh, let's go. Got some more rocket boys. There we go. We got we got seven hybrid incoming. Let's see how that does against this wave. I know they're coming in slightly in the back, not right on top of my front wave, but they're gonna come in just on time. Trust me. They're gonna come in just in time to support my Aegis guards, to support my Ultralis, and to just pound away at everything he's got here. Um, come on. Let's go. Seven hybrid push. This is this is my this is my hail mary. If I don't make it. Then that's that's probably it. It looks like I'm not making it though. Um, come on, hybrids. They're holding the line quite well, but oh my god, these swarm pulse are just so powerful. And I don't actually get any bonuses on them. Um, oh, oh my goodness. And yeah, a swarm pulse are just way too strong. Oh, okay. Um, I got I got more shock divisions lined up now, but I think uh, can I get can I get Emperor Shadow? I think does that. Because the pyrokinetic emulation causes an explosion. So I think I could try Emperor Shadow. I think I could try Emperor Shadow. Because I'm actually not quite sure. This, that was my Hail Mary and it did not go very far. Um, they have access to much more hybrid. But oh, shielding the buildings. Actually, that actually went a lot further. Because I think it destacked the Swarm Host. Uh, so there's some, okay, there's some guys coming in now. I'm going to go for an Emperor Shadow. I'm going to put her right here. Emperor Shadow. So let's see. You're in Pyrokinet. Emulates a target bio biologic enemy. Oh, it's irradiate. It's basically science vessel irradiate. Okay, that's good. Invulnerability for five seconds. Uh, EMP stun duration. Drains a hundred shields. Depletes the energy of enemy units. That's very good, actually. Okay. Well, Emperor Shadow. Hopefully, you don't get feedback by um, the High Templar, the High Archons, because that would suck a lot. Um, okay, there we go. Uh, Emperor Shadow. Oops, I put that Emperor Shadow when a uh, Shock Division was still training. Oops. Oops. All right, it's fine. Uh, we we just got we, we, we need to get more rocket boys. Uh, all right, rocket boys, let's go. Rocket boys to wipe out those Abathur air units. Rocket boys to wipe out those Phoenix. Menx is actually so versatile. I love him. I love his versatility. Like I enjoy commanders that have multiple options. Um, commanders that have not enough options, I don't enjoy as much. Uh, okay, so the the medevacs just went down, but they seem to be doing it. Uh, 
a very good job at uh, ensuring that the stuff stays alive. Um, at Rocket Boys, kill those Vipers, please. Oh no, they're getting obliterated by those Guardians. Good thing I have more of them. Oh yeah, this is the real Manx bio experience. All right, let's get them, boys. For the Emperor of Man, the Dominion shall overcome. We'll destroy these foreign invaders or or whatever. However, Manx goes about and says it. Like we shall endure or something. I don't remember. Like when he's like trying to prepare Core Hall for like being attacked by Kerrigan. Uh, where were his royal guards, honestly? Where were his royal guards when a Core Hall was under attack? Either? How did he even lose Core Hall with these royal guards? Uh, there we go. Yeah, that's a lot of guys coming out though. Avatar and them are just hanging off for dear life. But my shock divisions are just pounding the stuff. Like each hit by the shock division is actually obliterating these locusts. Uh, and that's very good for me. Uh, very bad for them. Uh, I have a ghost here somewhere. I don't know what she's doing, but like I hope she's doing something good. I just have her on auto cast at this point. I think she just got feedback. Um, I think it would be helpful if I had some more medevacs. Um, just cause. Why not? Just have medevacs. Um, armament stabilizers. So I don't actually know how to get the shock division onto the uh, medevac, but I'll see. Let's get my next tier upgrades. I've got a lot of rocket boys right now, so air is not a problem, ground is not a problem. Um, it's just getting past the swarm host line, that's the only problem. Like, without these swarm hosts keeping them afloat, like, no chance, no chance. Uh, but it looks like his swarm hosts are stacking now, because he's stacked onto the Nexus. A big rope. Oh, look at how many swarm hosts there are. That is actually disgusting. Am I against two avatars, by the way? I actually. Oh no, it, 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 there's one opponent that's missing. Let's just double the avatar that's spawning. Uh, that we're seeing right now. Um, wow. Oh my god. That's a stack of swarm hosts. Uh, ooh. Come on, shock divisions. Uh, I think I need I need to get more strike. I need to get some strike weaponry so that my units attack faster. Let's go. Uh, here we go. That's exploding. But uh, I think I think I probably get some Aegis guards, more Aegis guards, uh, or more shock. I think I get more shock divisions, honestly, because the shock divisions are the ones that that are that end up surviving in the back every time, and they always continue to survive. So if I can stack more shock divisions. I think eventually I will win. So I, w I have... That 7 hybrid push did not even get me that far. Jesus. Um, the shock divisions on the ground are doing God's work right now. But uh, the witnesses are not... Oh my god, those shock divisions could have been killing those witnesses. I mean, killing those uh, swarm hosts. But the witness is just being uh, being bad. Because it just sieges up and it stops moving forward. Yes, it has increased detection range, but that's about it. And oh, there's, there's my detection going down. Um, I can get more witnesses, but they don't stack. That's the only issue. Um, let's get another ultra scout here. Uh, we going, we going ultra boys. Um, let's go. Come on, let's get another shock division. Uh, right here. I'm gonna probably need some more flame boys in the back, to be honest. Um, this guy's gonna be a flame boy. Uh, bam, 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 bam. Oh, they're slowly pushing back into us again. It's gonna be a long grind. This is gonna be a hella game. This is gonna be a game that you must see. Um, let's see. Wow. All right. Uh, whoa. Let's see. That's a lot of phoenixes, by the way. Do I have enough rocket boys to take all this stuff out? The answer is yes, I think. I might want to get Black Hammer to get some armor on my guys. Um, Black Hammer's Overwatch buff. You have to be so close to Black Hammer, but that's the only thing I don't like. And that is a huge stack of units, and uh, I don't know if I can beat that. Avatar is like fat stack of that stack of guys is actually going to crush me. Uh, Alright, please, please smash these swarm hosts. I cannot allow any swarm hosts to survive. Because uh, the more swarm hosts that survive to the next wave, the worse off I am going to be. Uh, we got shock divisions in the back. Three of them this time. Uh, I think I just I think I just got to keep pushing out shock divisions. Like, it doesn't matter if that they're leveled up or not. Like I just got to get two shock divisions out at a time. I think two is probably the maximum you want to be training with world guards at a time. Two, two at a time. Like anything else, anything more is like it's a bit risque. Uh, okay, so okay, so you boys get the get the flamethrower. There we go. Get a flamethrower, boys. Uh, all right. Oh my god. Next tier of upgrades is up already. Uh, I need more flamethrower boys in the back. Yeah. So they're running up to the front. They're gonna replace the boys in the front that died. Pick up your weapons. Uh, woo, getting burned down. 
Uh, our Rocket Boys are down. Oh my god, look at that. The Shock Divisions are not even close to being able to hit those Swarm Hosts. Um, there's so many Swarm Hosts. Oh my goodness. The Ultralists are going in for the flank, though, so that's pretty good. Um, but they're they're just dying to the Artanis. The heavy Artanis fire. Um, the heavy anti-armor fire. Ooh. I have six Shock Divisions here, then they're still pumping out rounds. Uh, not six. I have, I have not six. I have four. Okay, so we got more Ultralists here. Um, but, oh my goodness, what is that? Is that a Brutalist getting immolated? Oh shoot, that's the Ghost getting off the this Power Kinetic Immolation. Uh, let's get the scan going so that at least my guys can uh, see what's going on and blow them up. Come on, get rid of those things. Get rid of those things on the ground, please. Shock Divisions, please. Aw, oh, dude, we lost sight. We lost vision. Oh man, Shock Divisions. Shock Divisions coming in. Uh, we need more Shock Divisions. Honestly, I think Shock Divisions will win me the game. We went Aegis Guard opening into Shock Division transition. I think that's pretty good. Um, let's see. Because it's, it's mainly just having to decimate this ground this ground stuff, so I just need more Shock Divisions. More Shock Divisions, let's go. Uh, and we need... I think we could... There's an argument to be made for more Rocket Boys. Uh, so these guys will go here, and then this guy will go Rocket Boy. Uh, and I will also be able to save up for more hybrids. Um, so I probably have four hybrid. I have four hybrid ready to go on push. But let's just wait. I'm gonna get some. I'm gonna get an EXP modifier right here. There we go. And I'm gonna go for strike weapons if I can. If I can, because we have so many shock divisions now. Now, now my shock divisions are starting to stack up because they spawn every single wave versus theirs spawns every two waves. Um, here we go. Like I think if it was if it was me versus Abathur, I would probably lose. Uh, but against um, against Artanis, it's probably not that bad. Um, because Artanis' Phoenixes don't actually do much to me. And uh, I have so many Shock Divisions that his armored frontline is just going to disappear. Um, shock Divisions, baby. We got the Smart Servos, so Manx got the Fast Siege on his tanks as well. Um, all these Shock Divisions are just... Like, this entire army is now just here to keep the Shock Divisions alive. Like, at this point, it's like, keep the Shock Divisions alive. Uh, okay, there's the Detection Range. We are on the Swarm Host line. The Shock Divisions have finally stacked... This is the Shock Division Death Stack, boys. Um, oh my god, do not mess with the Shock Division. They are obliterating these Artanis Immortals. And mind you, Artanis Immortals have 500 HP. So they are very strong. They're not, nothing, no, no, no pushovers. But uh, we are just running over them like they don't exist. Wow. Have I finally done it? Have I finally broken Abathur's Siege Line? Oh my god, there we go. We got that huge uh, immolation on the Brutalist. Power Command immolation. Um, Although Abathur is probably going to break my Shock Division Siege Line, unless my guys come in fast enough. Oh, Emperor Shadow just went down. Something on the ground here. I wonder where that came from. Um, my uh, Metavacs are taking some of the Viper's energy. Shock Divisions are just blowing everything out of the water. I'm going to drop a scan so my Shock Divisions can continue seeing what is going on. Uh, I have enough for four hybrid to push, but I don't want to get greedy. I want to hang on. What is this? <laughs> what is that Ultralist doing? We got, we got a little distracted over there. Uh, uh oh, my shock divisions are disappearing now, so that means my ability to stack here is going to go down. But I'm spawning six shock divisions every wave now, I think. Um, and that is going to be, like, a killer for him. Um, there are units on the ground here, aren't there? Uh, there are. So, But they're on their nexus now, though, so that's going to make it a little harder for me to push in. But uh, nothing a few more shock divisions can't solve or can't fix. Uh, okay, so these shock divisions are still training. Uh, oh, now I have six shock divisions. Okay, there we go. Um, just more shock divisions, please. Shock divisions, please. We are on their nexus, and that looks like it's gonna be game. That was a hard-fought victory, boys. Um, but hard-fought victory, but definitely that was an amazing game. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like. Uh, and oh, 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 overview, overview. Let's see the overview. Uh, I killed 2,800 units, and I lost 7,000. Well, those are all my flame boys that died, but I dealt a million damage. Wow. Okay. Um, Wow, okay. Well, if you guys enjoyed that video, leave a like, and I will see you guys next time.